What up, Bubs? It's boy Young Monty back with Pop. No, I don't know. I can't see it. Rides? Yes, I want to ride the Shumpa. All aboard! That's a good one, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Let's just see what happens if I die. I die! Shumpa launching! City. A Machina city, a thousand years old. They built the city on top of bridges across a river. But the weight of the city caused the bridges to collapse, and it all sank to the bottom. Right, it's a good lesson. A lesson? Yeah. Why build a city over a river, yeah? Uh, well, it would be convenient with all that water there. Nope, that's not why. They just wanted to prove they could defy the laws of nature. Hmm? I'm not so sure about that. Yevon has taught us. When humans have power, they seek to use it. If you don't stop them, they go too far, yeah? Uh -huh. Yeah, but don't you use Machina too? Like the stadium and stuff, right? Yevon, it decides which Machina we may use and which we may not. So what kind of Machina may we not use, then? Remember Operation Meehan? That kind. Or war will rage again. War? More than a thousand years ago, mankind waged war using Machina to kill. They kept building more and more powerful machina. They made weapons so powerful, it was thought they could destroy the entire world. The people feared that Spira would be destroyed. But the war did not stop. Wh what happened then? Sin came, and it destroyed the cities and their machina. The war ended, and our reward was Sin. So, sins are punishment for letting things get out of hand, eh? Man, that's rough. Yeah, it is. But it's not like the Machina are bad. Only as bad as their users. It's because of people like the Albed screwing everything up. Ugh. What could that be? Sit down. Sorry! Ah! The outfit!
this one do jack shit. Cause it's a machine. Wow, that was a man. Go again. Are you hurt? Uh, no, I'm fine. Oh, the jittery <sighs> dingle dangles. <sighs> Those out bed. Is everybody okay? I I'm sorry. We're all okay now. Yuna. Uh <gasps> Shoot a full speed ahead. Damn the out bed. What do they want from us? Could it have something to do with Luca? What do they have the uniform? Wait, they're mad they lost the tournament. Oh wait, they're mad about Operation Meehan. I wonder, didn't Kamari's clansmen say something about summoners disappearing? Ah, so the outbed are behind that. Those sand plastic grease monkeys. Hey, Waka. It's no use complaining about the owl bed now, right? We'll protect Yuna from anyone, anywhere. It's that easy. 
That's all I need to know. Well, I guess so. You're right. <laughs> okay. Nothing there, but put it like a silent whisper. Yay, I'm here now. I don't have to do that fucking fight again. This is the last time I moved to you, but you're down. Gimari fail as guardian on Shubop. Gimari never fail again. Okay. Might be more out bed. Keep watch, yeah? Looks like we're stuck here for a while. I just go. I just bail. Oh, you're here again. I'll walk. Got just the regular shit. Hello, chest. <gasps> Look who it is! Thank you! You're not dead? Ah, uh, ah? Uh? back there. Ah. Riku! You're Riku! Uh, hey! Uh, you're okay! How you been? Terrible. Yeah, you don't look so good. What happened? You beat me up, remember? Huh? Oh! That Machina? That was you? You know, you big meanie. <sighs> w wait, but you attacked us. Nuh-uh, it's not exactly what you think. Yo! Friend of yours. Uh, and you could say that. Pleased to meet ya. I'm Riku. Yuna, Lulu, I told you about her, remember? She was the one who helped me before I was washed up on Besaid. She's an Albed. <sighs> wow, so you like all your life. What luck meeting here, huh? Praise be to Yevon. Yeah. So, uh, Riku, you look a little beat up. 
You okay? Uh, Waka. Huh? What? There's something we need to discuss. Oh, go ahead. Girls only. Boys, please wait over there. Right. Sorry, Waka. Huh? What? <laughs> <laughs> Sir Oren, I would like Riku to be my guardian. Show me your face. Huh? Look at me. Oh, okay. Open your eyes. As I thought. Um, no good? Are you certain? A hundred percent. So, anyway... Can I...? If Yuna wishes it. Yes, I do. <laughs> Riku's a good girl. She helped me a bunch. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm for it. The more the merrier. right -o. Then I'll just have to be the merriest. It was strange. Even though Waka had always hated the Albed. Riku, at your service. He never realized Riku was one of them. So you can ask right about here. Spear chain. Ooh, that was cool. Ooh, a treasure chest. I wonder what's inside. You should know, I'm scary when I get mad. I'm gonna use that item I just got on you. You'll be sorry. Boomer. That's my What did you just do? That was great! I can combine items and use them like this. It's not that tough, really. I'm gonna make sure. That I have the overdrive. Brief doubt for you, but you're free. Might as well get you leveled up, I guess, since you're so weak. Well, not weak, weak, but your health is low. Let's see what I'll fight you for. Watch. Huh. I foresee no difficulty. Uh, 
I'm not used to seeing so many people on the thing. Not you. Not you. <laughs> Get you out of here. Let's kill you. I've always loved this flooring, it's awesome stuff. At least I have that path to grinding if I so wish. Or the Thunder Plains right next to what they're selling. We have been expecting you, Lady Yuna. Welcome to Guado Salam. This way, my lady. This way. Me? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, I beg your pardon. I am called Trommel Guado. I am in the direct service of our leader, the great Seymour Guado. Lord Seymour has very important business with Lady Yuna. Business with me? Whatever could it be, I wonder? Please, come inside the manor. All will be explained. Of course, your friends are also welcome. Twist our arms, why don't you? Ah, I almost forgot. I'll fiddle around with that when I do grinding and stuff, I'll fiddle. Here's where you get the weapons. 
Now here's, here's the thing. I don't want, I don't want yellow stuff. I want fucking um soft ones. Just looking around, I haven't been here in ages. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Stay close to Yuna. Yep, yep, all right. Stop. Why does he want to see me? Kimari not like Mr. Seymour. Uh, I don't like him either, because I know what the fuck he is. I don't like the smell of this one, eh? Uh, can I go back here? Oh, you're there. Alright. Couldn't see you from that angle. These are the past leaders of the Guado. They all look the same. Mr. Seymour doesn't look like them, no. Don't you know? The last leader. Maester Jiskel wed a human woman. She was Seymour's mother. Oh. Hmm. This way, please. Well, I was about to go that way anyway, so... I will go inform like Lord Seymour. Please wait here. There's no temple here in Guadalajara, see? Summoners usually just pass through on their way elsewhere. <laughs> what? I didn't even ask a question and you're explaining things. You'd rather I say nothing then? No, no. Maybe you finally believe I don't know anything about Spira. And maybe that means you believe me about Xanarkin too? Well... There are many things I do not know. Your Xanarkand is one of those things. I suppose I can't say what I think, either way. Still, be careful. You shouldn't tell other people. Yeah, I know. Stay on your guard. Why? This guy is just a priest, right? 
Those with power use that power. Maesters have power. Wait. You sure you don't have something against Yevon? <laughs> I lived a long time in Xanarkand. Ah. Oh. Right, that is super brief. I get the feeling he called us up here for more than just dinner. We have a little food looks great. Kimari speak no more. Yeah, you got told off. What could it be? Oh. What have you got to say? You just eat it? Mm, this is good. I had to eat. I had to talk to everyone. I eat. eat. To have guests again. Since Lord Jiskel passed away, these halls have been too quiet. The death of Lord Jiskel was a great loss for all of Spira. Was this Maester Jiskel really such a great guy? He brought the teachings of Yevon to the Guado. He was truly a great man. Truly a loss for us all. But now, a new leader, Lord Seymour, has come before us. Lord Seymour is the child of a guado and a human. He will be the tie that binds our two races together. But that is not all, I think. Lord Seymour, he will surely become the shining star that lights the way for all the peoples of Spira. That is enough trouble. Must I always endure such praise? What up, bruh? Welcome! You wanted to see me? Please, make yourselves at home. There's no rush. Please keep this short. Yuna must rush. Pardon me. It has been a long time since I had guests. Lady Yuna, this way. This sphere is a reconstruction created from the thoughts of the dead that wander the far. Xanarkand? Correct. Xanarkand, as it looked 1,000 years ago. The great and wondrous Machina city, Zarekin. She once lived in this metropolis. <laughs> she who? She was the first person to defeat Sin and save the world from its ravages. And you have inherited her name. It was my father who named me. Lord Braska was entrusting you with a great task. He wanted you to face Sin as Lady Unaleska did. However, Lady Unaleska did not save the world alone to defeat the undefeatable Sin. It took an unbreakable bond of love, of the kind that binds two hearts for eternity.
moving, but no talking. Because they don't want us to hear it. I don't know what it is. Because <laughs> I've played this game once before. Your face is beat red. You okay? He go on. He asked me to marry him. You serious? Uh, hey. You know what Yuna must do. Of course, Lady Yuna. No. All summoners are charged with bringing peace to Spira. But this means more than just defeating sin. She must ease the suffering of all Spira. She must be a leader for the people. I proposed to Lady Yuna as a maester of Yevon. Spira is no playhouse. A moment's diversion may amuse an audience, but it changes nothing. Even so, the actors must play their parts. There's no need to answer right away. Please, think it over. We will do so then. We leave. Lady Yuna, I await your favorable reply. Why are you still here, sir? I beg your pardon. We Guado are keen to the scent of the far plane. <laughs> oh, that's great. That was hilarious. Yuna, the High Summoner's daughter, Seymour, the leader of the Guado, married in the name of Yevon, overcoming the barriers of race. It would give Spira something cheery to talk about for a change. Sounds just like a passing daydream, like Oren says. Come on, let's just get on with the pilgrimage. I mean, marriage? Hmm, jealous? What? No way. We gotta defeat sin. Romance can wait. You sure picked a fine time to lay this one on us. Maybe it is a fine time. You serious? If my getting married would help Spira, if it would make people happy, if I could do that for people, maybe I should do what I can. I never imagined doing anything like this, but I won't answer till I know what's right. Seriously? You could always just quit your pilgrimage and get married. <laughs> I will. Go on. I'm sure that Lord Seymour will understand. Um, I guess so. I am a summoner. I must fight and defeat sin. Like Braska before you. <laughs> I had to stop myself from shouting. What's there to think about? I'm going to the far plane. I'm going to see my father and think on this. Go on. We'll be right behind you. Mm. Yeah, I wondered why none story. of the others ever asked Yuna. Do you love Seymour? Do you even like him?
3,000 kill, I shall take that. It takes up 3,000. Okay. Question about this far plane. When somebody dies, a summoner sends them to the far plane, right? So their souls, or whatever they are, uh, they go to the far plane, right? But that's the far oh plane we're going to, right? <laughs> and Yuna's old man's there too? Do dead people live there or something? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> you thinking those funny thoughts again, yeah? <laughs> You'll see once we get there. Yep. Yeah. Aren't you coming? I do not belong there. <laughs> You're scared. Searching the past to find the future. This is all that is there. I need it not. You'd better be going. You're not really going to see the dead. More like your memories of them. People think of their relatives, and the Pyreflies react to them. They take on the form of the dead person. An illusion, nothing else. Hmm. Well, have fun. What? You're not going either, Riku? I keep my memories inside. Huh? Memories are nice, but that's all they are. All right. What the? The far plane was cool, but I couldn't stop thinking about Yuna. Her parents, they look so happy together. But it got me worried that maybe seeing them would make Yuna really consider Seymour's proposal. Why don't you try calling someone? All you have to do is think about them. Yo, Chapu! Meant to come see you earlier, yeah? Sorry. I know you won't hold it against me. Eh, ah, I gave up that game. I'm a guardian from here on, you know? This guy looks a lot like you. Showed up. Traveling with him, I thought maybe you were still alive somewhere, yeah? But then again, here you are on the far plane. Guess your place is here. So? How you been? Oh, that guy I just told you about. I gave him your sword. He likes it. Huh? Wow. It's one of the best swords ever. So, uh, Yuna? 
I've decided. Uh, oh, really? Uh, that's good. I remember when I was only seven years old in Bevel that day. My father had defeated Sin, and the whole town was out in the streets. Everyone was laughing. They all seemed so happy. If I defeated Sin, that would make everyone happy, wouldn't it? Uh, uh, yes. I must do what everyone wants, not just what I want. Let's go back. You gotta tell Seymour. Before that, call Sir Jet. Give it a try. Huh? Don't worry. He won't come. Trying not to think about my old man made me think about him, of course. See, told you. He isn't here because he's not dead. He's sin. <laughs> that means he's alive, you know. What if my old man really is sin? What would I say to Yuna? Heck, uh, to everybody in Spira. Wait, why should I have to apologize for him anyway? I'd rather never see him again. What makes you hate him so? Everything he does just makes me mad. It was his fault that me and my mother... Uh, uh, Mom? It, it's her. She's very pretty. But, wait, no one ever performed the sending for her. She must have accepted death while she was still alive. Whoa there, uh, that's my mother you're talking about. Oh, I I'm sorry. Hmm, it's okay. Uh, I think I just figured something out. What? Why I hate my old man. Oh, flashback. See, See so, so I, told I told him what I thought of him right, right there. there. What? Really? Of course. <laughs> I suppose, <laughs> but... Mommy! Just, Just a sec, dear. dear. Whenever my old man was around, my mother wouldn't even look at me. Maybe that's when I started to resent him, even hate him. When he left us, Mom just lost her energy. Is she all right? Why should you care? If she dies, I wouldn't know what to do. Don't say Mom is gonna die. I apologize. The old lady next door told me, when a lovebird dies, the one left behind, it just gives up living so it can join its mate. It was just like that. I hated my old man even more. But really, my old man... Mommy! Just a sec, dear. Ah, uh, go to him. You'll cry if you don't. Oh, man. Hmm? I must sound so stupid. I don't think so. How embarrassing. Well, need some more time. No. I'm ready. Did I miss something? I'll go give my answer to Maester Seymour. Oh. Lord Jiska! Oh, Lord Jiska! Uh, he does not belong here. Why? Yuna, send him. Lord Jiskel no more. Send him now. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. 
talk later. We leave now. Yep, because you do not belong here. Uh, what was that just now? That really Lord Disco? I don't understand how a man like Lord Jiskel can die and not be sent. I would think that he was sent once, but he stayed on Spira. Something, a powerful emotion, could have bound him to this world. Such things happen. That's against the rules, isn't it? It means he died an unclean death. I will go. Meet with Maester Seymour. Yuna! Jisco is the Guado's problem, not yours. Um... What? So, Lulu, what do you think about Yuna getting married? As long as the pilgrimage continues, either way's fine. That's it? What if she doesn't even like the guy? Is that okay? People marry for many reasons. What's that mean? Sometimes marriage doesn't require love, you know? Defeat sin and bring joy to the people of Spira. Get married and bring joy to the people of Spira. For Yuna, they're just two ways down the same road. All you need is determination. If you have that, you don't need love. I don't know. Mm, I just don't get it. Endurance training, stay out of your way. Okay. Well, I'm going to save it here. On next time, because what? Did a boss fight, did some fighting, massive cinematic exposition right now, and we'll deal with it with it this time. So, I hope you enjoyed the lovely dead dinner and stuff. But, yep, we're doing it next time, we're doing the rest next time, because we're at just over 52 minutes, so I think that's more than enough time. So, bye!